we're all familiar with the Gemara, with the story of Kamsa Bar Kamsa. The Chazal explained that the Churban came about by a bizarre story with, with a misunderstanding between the name Kamsa and Bar Kamsa. Somebody, there was a host who had a friend Kamsa and a and a an enemy Bar Kamsa, and um, he sent somebody to call Kamsa to his party. By mistake, Bar Kamsa came. The host kicked out Bar Kamsa, and um, apparently, in a very um, embarrassing way, he kicked them out. No, no, with that with no regard for his, his, his pride, Bakamsa gets so upset and he goes and he, he goes to the Roman to the Roman Caesar and he and he gets and he makes up a story and he gets and he gets the ball rolling for the Chorb. The problem was like this. The Gemara says the Gemara starts to it's a Gemara in Gittin. It's a Gemara in Gittin Daphne and Hamid days. And uh, on the bottom of Nun Hayamid Beis, Om Rabbi Yechna, Mai Dechsev, Ashrei Odom Mefachet Talmud. What does Shleim Amelach mean in Mishlei when he says that praise is a person that's Mefachet Talmud, that's always worried. He's uh, he's always he's he's always he has. Uh, Rashi explains Mefachet Talmud. Rashi explains Doyig Lirais Hanoyled. He's always worried to see. To, 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 he's always worried about the outcome of his actions. That, that something bad shouldn't come out from what he does. And so, on that small little thing of a time ago, a time ago, to Chorv to Malka, and a Saka District Chorv Beta, those are another two stories that the Gemara brings afterwards. So the problem is like this. In the story of Kamsu Bar Kamsa, it doesn't seem like it was, it was just a small Kamsu Bar Kamsa is the reason why you, why Yishalayim was Kharav. There's, there's some very, very big, ba- there's some really bad actors here. We're talking about somebody, Bar Kamsa, that came to, showed up at this, at this ball, showed up at this wedding, at this Simcha, at this uh, um, party, by mistake, and the host hated him so well that there was no money in the world that Bar Kamsa was able to do to save face. So this host seems like a very, very, very mean person. He was able to. He was willing to be over. Malvim um, Chaveri uh, Berabim in such a, such a, a such a an egregious way. This doesn't seem like something small. It doesn't, and it has nothing to do with Ashi Odom and Fachet Tomid. Had he had a little bit more Yerushalayim, he was a he was a monster. He was Malvim Chaveri Berabim. The next, the next. Um, and and and, and Barkamsa himself, he turns around and he goes and he and he makes up a story about Kans Kaisol yeah, to the Caesar over this, and and what 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 happened? One little change, in one story, and and he, he he turns around and becomes such a monster. So the truth is that there are some that say that that Rabbi Yechonon is does is not referring to Kamsa Bar Kamsa Chavi Shalayim. He started off his member Ashi Adam Mefachet Tamid, but a Kamsa Bar Kamsa, but but it's not going on Kamsa Bar Kamsa. It's going on the other cases, the other stories that happen. Rashi doesn't tell us if it is or it isn't. So I would assume Rashi, I mean Rashi doesn't allude to such a concept. And Tosis clearly says Tosis Divrei uh, Amaskal Ashi Adam Mefachet Tamid clearly says. That Ashi Odom Mefachet Tamid is going on the case of of Kamsu Bar Kamsu. So we're back to this question: What is? We're not talking about some kind of a, some kind of a, um, some some kind of a, uh, a method. If one will be Mefachet Tamid, he won't come to such a crazy story. We're talking about very, very, very um, obvious and 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 nasty people doing very, very, very nasty things. And it, this is not not something we need Shleim HaMelech to teach us. Maybe we can understand that there was a, a string of misunderstandings here that went on through the story. And everybody here thought that they were 100% in the right. And the only way for us to, to, 
to, to, to save ourselves from such a terrible story happening is only with that, that extra Asher the Mefachet Tomet. And it'll have a, 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 a it'll, will, it, it will make the story much, much more related, much, give us much, much more of a connection to the story because, because this is something that could happen anywhere. Let's go back and see what happens. The, 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 the Shliach goes to, to Bar Kamsa and tells him that he's invited to the party. It didn't dawn on him. Why should it dawn on him that the, that the Shliach is making a mistake? So he assumed, and this the Masha suggests also, that he assumed that the host finally wants to make up. And how, how better could he make up by giving him an invitation, a personal invitation, to, 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 to come to his, his, his event? Beautiful. So Barakamsa puts on his nicest suit and he shows up to the, to, the, to the event. The host doesn't know anything about this, about, about, about this mix-up. And he sees his biggest enemy, or his enemy, show up to his event, to his chasna, all dressed up like he belongs. What's he doing? It must be, the host thought, that he came to ruin my wedding. Such he hates me so much that he wanted to be in my face during my happiest moment. That seems like a very, very, very nasty thing for the for for Bakamsa to be doing. So the host obviously and justifiably so asked him to leave. What are you doing here? Why did you come to ruin my wedding? Barkamsa, not understanding that there was a misunderstanding didn't say anything, and the host insisted until he threw him out because he saw Bar Kamsa as the aggressor. He saw Bar Kamsa coming to ruin his event. And everybody there also thought that way. They also had no reason to think that there was some sort of a mix-up in the, in the, in the messenger. They assumed that, that the host, that, 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 that Bar Kamsa came to ruin his event. And Barakamsa took care of it. Nothing wrong there. But what was going on at Barakamsa? Now that we have the third level. What, what was going on at Barakamsa's mind? He sees he got invited. Regular official invitation. He gets invited to the event. And then everybody is fine with him being thrown out on his head. So he started thinking that this was a whole conspiracy. His this host that hated him so much decided to get at him in such an ugly way by inviting him, him coming all excited in his Shabbos suit and then throwing him out on his head. And not only was the host in on it, but all the people around were also in on it. These people are so terrible. I have to get back at them. I have to something and look how, look how through and through and so corrupt the whole community is that they should all gather together to, 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 um, to, to bavel him so badly. We got to do something. And he, and, and he went to, to Caesar. So obviously he shouldn't have gone to the Caesar. But we're not talking about some really, really, really nasty, nasty people. We're talking about the whole, the whole thing was a whole string of misunderstandings. He was never supposed to be invited. Um, 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 he was um, the, the the host never um, the, the host was wrong by thinking that that Bakamsa came to 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 um, to to, uh, to to ruin his event, and and Bakamsa was wrong by thinking that the host invited him to throw him out. How do you? How do we? How do we? Um, how do we? Refrain from such a misunderstanding, which could happen anytime. Only if somebody's mefachet on it. That means he's always walking around with that pachat, with that yur, with that. He's he's always afraid that who knows, maybe something terrible could happen. Let me look into the case before I act, before I do something, before I say something, before I throw him out, before I I I, I show up, before I, I I go to the case. Uh, maybe there was a misunderstanding. Maybe there's some more to the story. Maybe something else happened. That's the only way that we could that 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 somebody could be saved. Ashi other mefache tamid, and maybe that that's talked up shot. And everybody wants to know why it's sin aschinam. What is sin aschinam? A sin is a terrible thing. What's sin aschinam? 
if it was all a misunderstanding, and the whole thing was all, all built up, and everybody's one misunderstanding led to another misunderstanding, which led to a third mis- misunderstanding, so then we could understand it's a sinas had, had, had Had they discussed it one to the other, or somebody somebody stopped it, and had they figured out that this was this was all one big misunderstanding, we wouldn't have had the korban. This is something that obviously we could we could use in our own life. Obviously, obviously, um, um one one small misunderstanding could be could be rectified before it before it it, it gets out of hand and before it spirals out of control.